With the hardware configuration open, double click the CPU to open its properties. Click on the startup tab. The preset configuration is the set of data blocks created when the hardware configuration has been saved and compiled. The actual configuration is the physical hardware system managed by the PLC controller or CPU. By default, there's a check in the box, startup if preset configuration does not match actual configuration. If this box is unchecked and there is a configuration mismatch between the preset and actual, the CPU will switch to the stop mode. Typically, this box is left checked. With most S7300 CPUs, such as this 315-2 PNDP, warm restart is the only option. What this means is that if the CPU is switched from stop to run or power is cycled, the CPU calls once for organization block OB100 and then the normal cyclic operation begins. The monitoring time field next to finished message with module is the amount of time that the modules in the central rack have to return a ready signal to the CPU. For example, if this value is changed to 500 milliseconds, then after 500 milliseconds, if the CPU did not get a ready signal from each module in the central rack, it would respond depending on the check mark in the startup if preset box is checked or not. After the CPU receives a ready signal from each module in the central rack, then the monitoring time next to transfer of parameters to modules is the amount of time for this CPU to transfer parameters to the modules in the central rack. If the modules do not receive the parameter transfer during this time, the CPU will respond according to the check mark in startup if preset box is checked. If the CPU has a Profibus DP master port, then this time will apply to the transfer of parameters to the Profibus DP.